I'm going to tie the full Windsor knot, which was first created by King Edward VIII before he abdicated. He was the Prince of Wales, quite a dapper character in his day. This tie, ideally, should always be worn with a waistcoat, so it's an ideal tie knot for weddings and special occasions. First of all, a very short end here because you're going to use up an awful lot of tie to tie this knot. Bring it across at the front and then back around at the back and draw it over the top for the first pass, as they call it. Bring the tie through and bring it across on the rear of the tie and then bring it through at the front for the second pass. Then around at the back once again and bring it over for the third pass and around at the back again across for the third pass. And finally, bring it across at the front, loop it at the back, draw the tie through the knot, tighten it into the neck, and there you have the perfect Windsor knot with the ends ending up virtually level. That, behind a waistcoat, is a perfect tie knot for either a special occasion, going racing with a waistcoat, or a wedding.